Hi and welcome. Well, this is just a continuation of the little fire starting videos I'm doing. So what I've got in here is some laboratory grade potassium panagamate. You can see there. Again, with any chemical, always important to read the safe data sheet that comes with it so you know the kind of dangers you're going to come across. Now, it's quite a, a well-known fact if you add a glycol or something like that to um, potassium panagamate, it will ignite. So what I've got here in a syringe is uh, some antifreeze that I'd have if it say I was vehicle born and I just so happen to have some potassium panagamate in my kit for water purification, for example, then I could do the mix up between the antifreeze and that to start a fire if needed as a as a last resort if anything else. So let's just see. I've got a little little hole made in there. I'm not going to touch it. I'm just going to leave it and see what it does. Already, I can see little speckles of smoke coming out. If I bring that down a bit more. Now I'm not manipulating this at all, I'm not touching it. Any minute now, I can see the smoke coming out of it. Wait for it. It's fizzing. So again, in this particular demonstration, I'm not touching it. I'm just going to see what it does. So there you go. So it's quite explosive. As you can see there, great bed of embers. If I had a tinder bundle ready, I could pour that straight. I could even put that straight in the tinder bundle and light it and leave it. So it passively does it itself. There you go, look, one big ember. Solid. So that's me doing it without manipulating it. And again, it's left quite an impressive burn scar in the wood. Now, again, just because I'm a little paramaniac, put another load in, create a little well. Again, one, two, three, and this time, mix it around see there straight away a lot quicker quicker reaction it's starting to smoke up straight away i could even do that again that's quite an impressive ember that would certainly get a fire going so that's just potassium panagamate with excuse me <laughs> with some engine coolant again that's like solid there you go that's roasting up and again all the little bits there still fizzing away so that's another method thanks for watching 